Hello and welcome back guys. This is going to be a brand new series. Uh, I told you guys I'd bring this back in fall. And as you guys can tell by the beautiful colors around me, this is fall. This is uh, October, about mid-October. And uh, this is what fall looks like in New England. So it's my favorite time of year. Um, one, one aspect of New England that uh, we are sort of admired for. A really beautiful time of year. But we're back here at the swamp. And I'm sure you guys recognize this. Uh, we're going to throw in the bait trap again uh, because that was sort of a requested and a hot topic video. And um, this is the spot where I did the, the previous uh, short little series uh, in summer. And honestly, I'm a little bit tired of this spot. Uh, I'm looking to you guys for ideas and suggestions as what to do. Uh, if you'd like me to, you know, of course, go down that way or maybe bring my kayak down and throw the trap out in the middle of the water there, or like I said in my third part, or fourth part, I'm not sure which one, of the previous series, the waterfall over there, if you guys want me to throw it over there. Um, let me know in the next video. Uh, as far as today, we're just gonna toss it right in. And uh, actually on the second part of the last series, somebody mentioned dog food, and people seem to like that idea. So I did bring down a pretty large bag of dog food. And we're gonna give that a shot. Um, I got new rope here, because the last one uh, kept on ripping every time I threw it in the trap. And uh, it would end up, the trap would just end up in the water by itself. I couldn't get it out. And I got a little bit more cordage here that we're just gonna loop through these smaller holes. So I'm just gonna toss it right in, right out here probably. Um, maybe even over there by, that, by those trees. Just to change it up. I'm gonna throw it out as far as I can this time. And uh, we'll see what we get. So if you guys watched the last series, remember how to do this. Um, for those of you who have not seen the last series, I will quickly go over how this trap works. I'm not going to go into too much detail, just because I don't want to make you guys suffer. So this latch is in there like that, and you got two rocks that go in that will keep it down at the bottom, otherwise it will float in the surface of the water. And we're going to throw our bait in now, we're going to be pretty generous, we're going to throw it all in there. Now we're going to latch it together there. I'm going to take my thin line and just feed it through. Just tie it off real quick. Make sure, I want to make sure it doesn't come off because last time I threw this trap in, um, this line actually came unraveled and I had to come down with a kayak and basically push it up with a paddle and that was not fun. So now that that's tied there, I'm going to take this end of here and of course tie this together. There we go, we're all set. So this time I'm going to throw the trap in right here um, in comparison to the previous times we've done it. I threw it in over there once, and down there, and then once again way down there in the corner. Uh, really quick though, before I throw the trap in, I just want to show you guys this right here. This little stump right here is the work of a beaver. These are all his uh, little nibble marks on there. You can see where he chewed it down, and probably collapsed the tree, dragged it out into the water with him, and he built himself a little home with it. Um, there used to be one over down by that really beautiful tree over there. I don't know what happened to it. Uh, it disappeared a couple years ago. Uh, probably got washed away with a storm or something like that, but there definitely are beavers in here. And we haven't been lucky enough to see one yet, but who knows, one of these days maybe. So I'm gonna throw my trap in, and today is Monday, so we'll come back probably around Wednesday, maybe Thursday, um, soon enough that the animals or critters we catch don't starve but long enough that they have time to actually find their way inside. So, if you guys would like to see anything, make sure you comment, and I will see you guys on Wednesday.
somebody coming. <laughs> 